Back today is a very special day for a Kauai woman who is now 100 years old. Loved ones are taking this moment to look back on her many activities over the years, including her important work for advocating for Korean War veterans. Dylan Anchetta has her story. This is the story of my childhood neighbor turned lifelong friend, Mrs. Akio Matsuyama. She has finally turned 100. For many years, my family lived across the street from her in Lihue. And nowadays, I stay in touch by visiting her when I'm on Kauai at her independent senior living community. During our last visit, she praised Regency at Kuakea staff for the great care and their aloha. She also went down memory lane, recounting what it was like growing up near Kauai's halfway bridge many decades ago. Many things, you know, we used to swim, climb tree, pick mountain apple, bango, guava. We used to swim and fish a lot. A painting by her son of her childhood home now hangs in her living room. I just had good life. I don't know. We also went on a walk, and my mother and I were the ones that needed to keep up with her. In fact, that's her key to a long life. I cannot stay still. I like move around, you know. Stay active, yeah? Take part in things. I also learned that in addition to running several successful businesses with her husband, she spent many years advocating for the memory and honor of Korean War veterans missing in action. Her brother, Army Private First Class Takeshi Sasaki, was one of five soldiers from Kauai whose fate is unknown. Her family says she spent years searching for answers and worked to memorialize the fallen, getting federal agencies to dedicate plaques in their honor. She just didn't want these Korean veterans to be forgotten. And I think she just had a special place in her heart for these Korean vets. The family says the last known record of her brother was that he was wounded in battle and awaiting medical care. The rest remains unknown. Today, she enjoys a much simpler life, focusing on her quilting and crafting, and of course, daily walks. As the matriarch of Kauai's Matsuyama family, a tight bond with loved ones is a lesson passed down through her family tree. My dad and my mom, as busy as they were, we all grew up emphasizing family. They had a very good social life as well. They need time for the family and friends and neighbors too. Happy 100, Mrs. Matsuyama. Dylan and Chata, Hawaii News Now. Oh, what a life well lived right there. Happy birthday, Absolutely. Mrs. Matsuyama. Wow. Awesome. And she's so sharp and so right? active. So that's really admirable, right? Mm -hmm. Right on. Get out there and stay active. Mm -hmm. Gotta love it.